Good day everyone and welcome. Before we start, we have a disclosure. Please be aware of risk in the future trading. We strongly recommend to get educated before you start using a real money. Uh, today is uh, 2.41 p.m. 22nd of July. It's a Friday. And uh, we still have four charts open. Uh, we still have the Nasdaq on the three minutes. Already hit 15,000 on the last trade. We have the DAX uh, still on a 14,000 on the last trade. We have the DAX 10 range and it is uh, 10,000. And then we have the uh, DAX on a 100 take is another 10,000. Uh, today, and we still have a small charts like uh, uh, YM uh, uh, on the last trade. And now uh, we have, um, uh, this is it. Uh, and um, so we have the gold still open. Lately, the gold is uh, uh, really amazing. And uh, we still have the gold open. But this is it. That's all what we have left for today. Uh, when the market today opened, uh, all the ES chart hit the target. Most of the charts we have uh, hit the target within the uh, uh, first 15 minutes in the market. Uh, most of the auto trade hit, and uh, I showed that on the other channel live today. But uh, we will show you that most of those chart uh, that were finished from a, a daytime. And then we have a few for the afternoon session. If you notice on the chart, all of them, most of them, uh, closed before 10 o'clock. So uh, on the gold, uh, finish at before 10 o'clock, 3,730. The ES, two minutes. Uh, this is the afternoon session, 4,200 on the two minutes chart on uh, this one here it was the morning session on the nasdaq eight range 2490 one trade it was done one trade the trade started um, around uh, 9.52 Within two minutes, it was done. Three minutes, it was done. 2,490. On the seven range, uh, we got 1680. On the NASDAQ, uh, we got on the one minute, 5,155. That's why it was a close at 12 o'clock. It was a, a going taking the whole trend. The YM uh, took one trade and it was done 1045 and it was done at 937. On that trade was also done before 10 o'clock and it nailed 1550 on the NASDAQ 200 take. This one was done this is the morning session, uh, the European hours. It was a beautiful trend this morning, but we had to restart. But on on that morning trend, the European hours, it made 10 times what it made in the afternoon. And it is 1,385. And it was done at around 10.20. The Nasdaq 150, it was done at 10 o'clock and it is uh, 13.55. Of course, what you can do, you can right click and what you do, you reactivate the trade if you want to. And then you do this and now start from zero 
and then you start a fresh trade and uh, once the bar close you can go on the second round as you notice now all the numbers are gone and it's ready to go second round if you want to so when we say the, the auto trade finish at 10 o'clock does not mean you cannot keep trading if you want to you just reload the strategy if you feel like you can if you feel like it want to go one more round and the market is trending why not if you think the market not trending then stop on the first round you know it depends what you want to do and um, uh, on the EIS 10 range, we were done around 11.52, 3,250. So the longer uh, the, the, the charts were in the trade, the more money was. But it's not necessarily always uh, smart to keep the auto trade in the market all day long. On this one here, finished right away, 1,000 EIS. And... Um, CL one minute, 4,480. Uh, the CL 10 range uh, did also finish before 10 o'clock, 22.40. All the CLs, normally they are finished before 10 o'clock. Normally, I mean, there is an exception. There is nothing black and white in the market. Could be tomorrow a uh, different story. What happened in the past maybe will not happen in the future. I don't know. But lately the CL, the gold, the ES, the NASDAQ, they, they've been moving like crazy. Uh, CL 5 range done before 10 o'clock, 1,400. Before 10 o'clock the CL 8 range was done at 11.50. The Russell was done before 10 o'clock, as you see, and 22.95. The 8 range stayed a little bit longer, 10.58, and it was 1,570. The 7 range Russell was done at 11.95 and had a beautiful run, the European hours as well. The four range Russell finished also around 9.37, few minutes in the market. The Russell one minute took a very nice trade, beautiful trade, worked with it all the way down and it was 3,465. Uh, ES 9 range, uh, we are also done before 12 o'clock, 3,550 because of when we were in the, uh, on the other channel today, the market was not moving. And what this is what you see right there, the market was not moving. And then all of a sudden, uh, later on this afternoon, the market start moving a bit. And then uh, on the DAX 5 range, 1200 also it was done by 10 o'clock the afternoon session on the DAX just finished right now it is uh, 3000 uh, the DAX 2300 the DAX 8 range 1500 And the DAX 2 range 1000. The DAX 4 range 2975. The DAX on the 3 minutes 5300. The gold 1080. 3280 on the gold. 200 takes the gold 89 range did 2000 2300 on the gold 8 range also finished before 10 o'clock 
finish at 10 o'clock 1600 on the ym9 range uh, the gold six range also before 10 o'clock nasdaq 10 range before 10 o'clock 1920 it was done the gold three minutes 1200 the nasdaq nine range all of them around 954 around 10 o'clock all of them finished uh, nine range 2160 russell five range 1100 russell 1575 also before 10 o'clock es 10 range if finished around 12 o'clock 3250 and look at this all those area here was avoided the russell 9 range also finished before 10 o'clock 1795 the russell 100 take also finished before 10 o'clock 1295 so when we started uh, on the other channel we didn't have any more open charts you know this is really uh, 3,000, um, 3,100 on the ES8 range, finished around 1130, and um, 1300 on the YM, gold 5 range, also finished before 10 o'clock, 3,650. If you hear some music, we have a lot of uh, British uh, traders, very aggressive traders around this area here. And uh, they start early partying today. And uh, it's normal for them to sit from today, maybe till Sunday, no big deal. And um, uh, the, the gold, uh, 2890 um, the gold on the four range um, uh, 4000 before 10 beautiful right from the beginning all the way started that trade around 932 finish around 945 beautiful right on the gold 4020 he caught it from the beginning till the end not even a human can do that uh, cl 2000 uh, also this one here the cl uh, six range we showed this on the other channel because it was finished 3,400 on the 6 uh, range, YM 8 range 1,000, YM 5 range 1,300, YM 7 range 1,100, Scalpin. And then we have the gold 10 range uh, finished today uh, before 10 o'clock and 1880. Uh, the, the gold on the 150 ticks 3280 also finished before uh, 10 o'clock uh, then we have the ym6 range uh, scalpin 1630 uh, that is in your package over 15 auto trades a huge variety of a scalping to reversal to trading with the trend to pull back re-entry there is unlimited tools where it depends on the trader what he want to do in the market you're not stuck with one entry for the rest of your life and trying to cope with the market you have many tools you can choose from you have many doors you can choose from and you become a 
you choose what you like to do, whether based on a pullback re-entry, a huge big variety of scalping, swing trading, reversal, all kind of different entries from aggressive to conservative to a huge variety of filter where a trader have all the tools he needs and then he can choose which direction he want to go and be master with it. You know, it's like doctors, you know, some are specialized in their stomach, some people are uh, specialized with heart diseases and a trader should be specialized in, in, in one area in a, one type of an entry or two, three type of an entry with a different filter or he knows what time he needs to scalp, what time he needs to swing trade and what time he can reverse. The more educated person, the more he can use the tools in the proper moments. And it's not just a coffee machine you turn on in the morning and then you come back and you see your pot full of money. It never worked this way in the market. So the more knowledge you have, it's not the amount of money you have, it's the knowledge you have. If you have knowledge, you have 5,000, you can go very far with it. If you have 50,000 with no knowledge, uh, you're on your way out before you even start. So this is a serious business, especially when it comes to money. And please don't think auto trades are just like a dishwasher machine, you turn it on and the money is gonna drop on your head, left and right, please. This is a wrong message. Um, I show different uh, time of frame, uh, different type of an entry, and what you can do with it. There is a lot of potential to learn how we teach you how to approach this market, and then what you do, we are a tool provider, what you do with it. On the CL7 range, uh, we have um, one, uh, uh, 1,370, and it was done around 10 o'clock, 10.15, YM 1,000, ES5 range, um, 2,700, here it is, and it was done around 11.40, and um, it is 2,750. Uh, on the ES 150 takes, Scalpin uh, did 1,175 on 150 takes, and on the four range, did the 3,350. And this is a beautiful trade. Got whacked on the first two trades, the small trades, and then catch the rest of it, 950. On the ES7 range, uh, we got 3,700 and it was done before 12 o'clock. On the Russell 200, 1865. On the NASDAQ, this one was on the other channel today, and it did a beautiful job early in the morning, and then it did a beautiful job in the 
US market. This is the European hours and this is the US market. So it's uh, on a hundred take 5,500. The CL4 range 1,390. 2,730 on the CL, 2,440 CL9 range, also before 10 o'clock, and uh, the CL also before 10 o'clock, it was done 1960. Folks, we wish you a very pleasant weekend, and uh, to our trader, uh, please, uh, you need the link for Monday webinar, we change the link and uh, you can call the support they'll send you the link or you can email the support they send you the link for monday we have an upgrade on monday so it's every, very important uh, for our traders to be there on monday to get the upgrade it's free of course thank you very much god bless you all and wish you a pleasant weekend bye for now